Okay, so it is three o'clock right now, a.m., and I could hear the harp uh, frequencies turn on shortly before 3 a.m. And then now all of a sudden we have these like 40 mile, mile an hour winds. Well, maybe more like 35 mile an hour winds. We have light drizzle and So here's Broadway, got a little bit of uh, drizzle, so we have drizzle, you can see the streets, let me see if I can clean this lens here, and uh, yeah, it's, so yeah, so we have, Harp frequencies are are basically blaring, and it's likely that these frequencies have caused this this wind, this gust of wind. We had a little bit of rain earlier um, today, and just mainly in the evening, we had rain. There's the street sign out here. And so yeah, that's, harp frequencies are going off. So three o'clock, I've heard people say that uh, PG&E will recalibrate their smart meters at three o'clock, but this is, this is a little overbearing. You will hear, uh, it's like a, an, an idle, uh, an engine idling, a diesel engine idling right sort of outside your window almost. And or it may sound like a transformer. I don't know if you can see the trees starting to move quite a bit here with this wind kicking up. Yeah, it's, uh, I would say it's a good, good 20 mile an hour wind 20 yeah 20 maybe 30 mile an hour wind and so yeah that's probably the best you can see the trees moving a little bit here uh, yeah it's, and then right there you can almost see the tree above that sign so, and then, so three o'clock in the morning, and we have not very much traffic on the, on the highway. We, again, we have a little bit of drizzle in the air, and it's typical, uh, not very much traffic at all. And we have these, these three, well, they're, they're gusty. Gusts are pretty good right now. Um, and it's very likely that these gusts have been caused by our uh, radio frequency transmitters. Uh, they are they may also come from the Gwyn towers, the lower towers, um, cell phone towers. Basically, it's causing a vibration, and the vibration, uh, the vibration basically is, and there's a policeman. Hey, uh, what about these people with these frequencies? Oh, there goes another one. Uh, Three o'clock in the morning, and so apparently they know there's something up. Uh, and so yeah, uh, let's see if we can get this tree. There's a tree, there's a big tree right over there. You can't hardly see it, but yeah, we've got some pretty good gusts here going on right now. And
so yeah three it's probably 10 after three right now and so yeah they're not gonna let you sleep very well um, basically what it will sound like it'll sound it'll sound similar to like uh, those people who have you know the, the speakers in their cars you know those lo those loud thumper machines inside their cars it's almost like that but it's not an actual kind of audio s sound it, it it's more in your inner ear you can I can hear it in my inner ear and 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 basically you know I'm gonna nickname this thing the the uh, the diarrhea frequency and, and it typically will cause diarrhea um, actually I'm I'm gonna also put the pretense on it that it could cause stroke so if if your cardiovascular system is not in good shape uh, the vibration and you can see I'm moving a bit here now this, this wind is kicking up again uh, so yeah once again uh, the frequency could affect the cardiovascular system causing stroke I believe um, but I believe mainly what it is is basically it's this the frequency to uh, to manipulate the sprayed particulates in the air to cause weather changes to manipulate the weather to control the weather basically why would you want to control the weather well you can control the crops you can control um, uh, commodities market you can control insurance markets um, you can control crop growth um, there's a lot of motivations for uh, For uh, controlling the weather um, also you know it's basically it's like keeping people um, sort of in the dark as to the true uh, situation uh, with the um, the environment so if people are unaware of uh, for instance global warming or the deterioration of the environment you know they're not going to be doing the same thing they're not going to be buying the same stuff from Walmart or the same oil from their uh, local gas station or whatever and the petroleum industry is going to be basically sort of out of the loop if people think that you know the environment is really changing because of global warming and so that's one of the reasons you know they want to keep their markets stable so you know and basically it's about control it's about controlling the people the people what they do and what they think and that's basically what this whole thing is about so if you wake up about three o'clock, three o'clock is when um, your body goes into full rest mode, your liver starts to purify the body, and if you, your body is not relaxed at three o'clock when this happens, um, it's a circadian cycle, biorhythm thing that happens. Now, if you're unable to rest at this point in time, um, your body be will become filled with these toxins that they're spraying, barium, aluminum, strontium, chalk, things like that. It could be nanobots and things like that, which the public is pretty much kept in the dark about. They, the, the, the whole... Uh, 
you know, when I heard Trump say, oh, well, we're going to give you the best, and, you know, and I'm like, whoa, you know, shit, why don't they, why don't they kind of basic improvements here in the United States, you know, to improve the quality of life, you know, like stop spraying barium, strontium, chalk, coal ash and stuff in the air. Yeah, we've got, we've got probably about a 40 mile an hour wind kicking in now. And, uh, yeah, I would, I would, you know, just because of the coincidence of the, the frequency that I've been hearing, uh, I would say, and then these winds actually just started about mm, probably right around the, the same time uh, that, uh, that I started hearing these frequencies. But, but basically back to the subject, um, the subject, if you, if you are unable to sleep, and there goes another policeman, and if you are unable to sleep at this time when your body is supposed to be resting, you don't get the deep REM rest so your mind can reprogram and basically avoid fatigue and so basically you are more easily persuaded during the day so um, yeah it's it's about control it's about controlling what you do what you think what you breathe um, your environment yeah and that's what it's all about that's the motive behind this and for anyone who can't understand some motives there goes a policeman right there and if anyone can't understand those basic motives it's not particularly about money it's more particularly about controlling once again what you think what you do what you breathe um, your family your heritage your reason or logic to make decisions that will further your heritage and the wisdom that your lineage has passed down to you it's about confusing that whole link of lineage that your family or all your relations have passed down to you and that's what it's about and so and they would rather not have you know they would rather you be persuaded by something else Lady Gaga uh, Super Bowl um, political personalities etc and not have you uh, aware of any of their motives. That's, that's what this is all about. And every time I hear these frequencies, I think of that. We got the wind kicking up again. So it's, let's see if we can get any action here. I don't know if you can hear it, but it's these bushes. You can see the bushes here. And the flickering of these lights are the, are the bushes running across the the, uh, the billboard sign here. So yeah, and just so you're aware, um, most of your public officials will not acknowledge this kind of thing. Like I said, the military is probably 20, or the industrial military complex is probably 20 to 30 years ahead of what they will allow the public to know. Everything is compartmentalized, meaning that 
those who are in the government basically only do what is in their job description and so normally although they will represent a certain view they may not uh, broach the subject at all they may indicate that they are interested in the subject and or knowledgeable but in fact will do nothing about it um, until basically pinned down on the subject by their peers and what I mean by peers is basically you have to have a quorum five people or so right on them saying okay this is what's happening you know what can you do about it and of course most of them oh, will probably say this is not their job description uh, the typical saying is you know they that is above their pay grade so yeah that's what's happening and yeah you can start to hear we've got some winds kicking up here um, so yeah that's my rant man and I, and uh, so you're not alone man if you if this shit wakes you up you hear this like this vibration in your inner ear you get a stroke you get diarrhea yep somebody's doing it to you man and it's all about control controlling what you think your environment what you breathe what you consume etc and so yep signing out here from Northern California God bless you all and thanks for watching